know, as an actor, you're working and you have the relationship with the director. You know, it's it's a team thing going on. And uh, the last thing you want is for a director to tell you, okay, I'm, you're going to sit right there. You know, you you have thoughts and ideas about where your character is in this moment, in this scene, and you direct, mm -hmm. and then you go back to be an actor. You just have the, where do you want me? No one would ever want to hurt Evie. She would never want to hurt anybody else. She's better than that. She is exceptional. Often, when a director is not savvy enough to actually have a conversation with the actor. Sometimes it can be as simple as, oh my gosh, she looks so beautiful mm -hmm. right there. In that light. In that light, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. And Carrie and I, we were uh, doing a scene and she wanted to be up against this wall and I was like, I can't put you up against the green wall. <laughs> she was like, I just, green yeah. in the wall. <laughs> <laughs> and the undertones, and I was like, I hear you. I'm with you, I'm moving. Right, right. <laughs> but, Let me know, I'm good. But, I, but becoming a director <laughs> allowed me to be able to have that conversation yeah. and know that an actor would get it. Right. As opposed to when we're not being talked to or we're not being, um, have, we have a take and someone <laughs> yeah. is not saying, you know, that was great or, you know, try it this way. It's, it's not that we want praise, but as an actor, you want to hear some direction, I direction. Want to you want direction. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Totally. So something that's going to elevate the thoughts happens. that I've already so yeah. rarely happens. When anyone directs me, I'm like, oh, whoa, that was a good idea. Yeah. 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 That happens once, like, yeah. every two yeah. years. I don't know. Yeah. I feel like I have to do everything I on my own, that. and then I don't expect anyone to do yeah, anything. But the best directors that you've had are the ones that actually inspire something in you. You've, you've had a thought. You've been working on these lines. You've done all of your research. You've built your backstory as an actor. And those directors that can still come and tell you something mm -hmm. and you go, oh, wow. That yeah. helps, that helps. Yeah, mm -hmm. let me try it that way. Yeah, that rarely happens it's, though, I, you know, I feel, yeah. With my actresses, like, she, if it's a love scene, I'm like, put it at the beginning of the day because she doesn't yeah. want to eat before. Yes, see? <laughs> That's she so did, nice. Yeah. That's so, so, so nice. I don't, I've been nice so <laughs> What do you do when you don't want to do it and a director is sitting there That's saying... That's what lawyers are for. <laughs> <laughs> I say no. I say, yeah, yeah, I don't feel comfortable with that. Conversations yeah. Discuss it before that, you take yeah. the job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, sometimes it's just, it's you, you already have, have the job and the nudity yeah, conversation nudity didn't come up until... Right, right, right. Yeah. I know, <laughs> a couple yeah. seasons yeah. in. Yeah. And, you know, you yeah. get that script and go, whoa, mm -hmm. oh, hmm. Right. <laughs> um, that, that particular situation that I'm thinking of, I just didn't feel like that was honest to the character. I didn't right. feel like that's yeah. how she would be having sex. Right. So if mm. she was going to have sex, I just didn't see her having sex like that. Mm. So, right. And they got it. What have these roles sort of taught you guys about yourselves? Anything that sort of surprised you? Not so much that the character that I'm playing has taught me something, but the people that I'm working with, mm. the, the story that's being told has taught me something about people. All right, so what, I mean, American crime. What have you learned about people in that That so process? many people think that black people can't be elitist. Mm -hmm. That a black <laughs> elitist doesn't exist. Like, I mean, I'm just, like, surprised how many people are so shocked that mm -hmm. Terry actually exists. And I'm like, you don't know a Terry? <laughs> <laughs> I can show you three. <laughs> you know? So, um, which is fantastic that she gets to represent the Terrys of the world. But, um, <laughs> but just, just that um, w with American crime especially, that there's so many conversations that are going on within our own households mm -hmm. that because we're not, we don't know other people's experience, just how much we <coughs> don't know about each other mm -hmm. yeah. is amazing mm -hmm. to me. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more videos from The Hollywood Reporter. What was your first splurge, your big purchase when you landed your first breakout role? I want to know what your first big splurge was. <laughs> <laughs>